These are the fields at Porton Cross, running down to the sea. Porton Cross lies quite close to West Kilbride in North Ayrshire. These fields are essentially very similar to the maca, the very herb-rich, nutrient-rich areas near the coast, particularly in the Outer Hebrides. Here we have, for instance, the Lychnis Flos Kikuli, Ragged Robin. Below it is Silverweed. There's birds for trefoil there, a number of grasses, a number of uh, sedges present. Aragrass, and here we have a stand of yellow flag iris. There's also a sorrel here. This is growing on an underlying geology of red sandstone. It should be very silica rich certain amount of calcium coming in from seashells and so on broken up by wave action and blown inland. You also have sea scurvy grass here, this white flower, it's a plant rich in vitamin C and can be used to alleviate the symptoms of scurvy the uh, outward signs of which are uh, the teeth becoming very loose in their sockets, the gums becoming inflamed and the person's having it suffering from um, a bit range of the conditions because their immune system is weakened. The bird's foot trefoil, when it sets seed, the flower shape with the seeds makes it look very much like a bird's foot. Here are some, in fact, at a later stage, showing that. There's sea dock, that's the, the docken with the curler leaf. Sea pink or thrift, well known in the past for being the, the flower that was on the back of the threepenny piece, that is the, uh, the copper or brass one rather than the silver one. to the sea itself we have a lichen zone. This is the yellow splash lichen. And here is the sea ivory, another form of lichen. here, with the silvery appearance to its leaf. It's a milk thistle, a bit like a dandelion. There are some sea plantain and a sea arrow grass. The 
these are the runners of this silverweed. Makes it a very successful plant, a bit like a strawberry has runners. This can extend its dominance. The sward, the sward being the name given to the plant rich surface growth. So they can infiltrate in between other plants, outshade and generally predominate 